How's it going, everyone? Well, I have found a place to go to for the next time I come up here. And the reason why we're not doing it today is you've got to make reservations. It's a guided tour. You can't just come up here and say, walk on what I'm about to show you that's behind me. Because what you're seeing, it is not a lake. It is not a river. It is a glacier. And so you can't necessarily just go up there and start walking on your own. You actually have to go with the tour guide. But nonetheless, it would be an experience to actually be able to just walk up that dry dirt you see right that I'm pointing at and then walk your way right on up to the toe of that glacier. And especially if it's a hot day, like 75, 80 degrees and you're just w wanting to cool off, uh, they say that once you get up towards the toe of that glacier, you can actually feel the cold air blowing off of it. And you do need crampons or micro spikes. And that's just an experience that I would surely look forward to doing. Not gonna happen this time, but I figured I'd at least show you guys how long this glacier is. If you see back behind me, it goes back quite a ways. So it goes all the way back there. And see, that's the thing. Uh, 15,000 years ago, it extended another 50 miles down, I believe it was that direction. Pretty impressive when you think about it, because when you think of glaciers, you think of them on a steep slope, like in Washington State, Mount Rainier, Baker, they're on these steep slopes, but not on something flat like this. It almost reminds me of what you might see like in the Andes or the Himalayas. Almost kind of has that Himalayan feel to it. So it's, it's one thing that coming back up here, that is surely one thing I would have to do is at least, to, even if it's only the toe of the glacier, to say that I walked on, uh, I believe it's called the Matanuska Glacier. There are other glaciers similar to this, where it's like completely flat. It's like walking on a glacial sea. Yeah, that is something I would most certainly look forward to doing. But nonetheless, I figure why not? I'm gonna show you guys some of the views. And for any of you out there that do decide to venture on up here to Alaska, look that up. It's a uh, Matanuska Glacier, or just look at glaciers near Anchorage and you will find out and just have to you do have to go with the guided tour you can't just go up on there and just be like oh i'm gonna go walk on a glacier today it is guided so that's the only one drawback but just want to share that with you guys and i will be coming at you guys with more action i'll see you guys later on